Bosa watch continues as we head into the weekend, and Nick Bosa is still unpaid. And tomorrow, Sunday, is a week until the beginning of week one in Pittsburgh, where the 49ers will face the Steelers. And of course, everyone is wondering, where is Nick Bosa and when will he get signed? NFL insider Jeremy Fowler provided a bit of an update today in regards to what he would consider a... I would guess you would say trending in a positive direction in regards to the contract negotiations and basically what he expects to see from Nick Bosa and what the contract will look like. Listen to what Jeremy Fowler had to say right here. Nick Bosa and the 49ers, a bit more optimism here. People I've talked to believe that he will be the highest paid defensive player in the league above Donald's 31 plus million. If they can get this at the finish line, the 49ers would like to push this through before week one, but not a slam dunk. A deal of this magnitude has a lot of nuance to it that they have to shake out with the structure and the guarantees and all that. So as you can see, and as we've kind of connected the dots up until this point, it does appear that Nick Bosa and his camp is angling towards being the highest paid non-quarterback and the highest paid defender in the NFL, which is basically eclipsing what Aaron Donald has been paid at an average of $31 million per year. So I'm guessing Nick Bosa is north of that or trying to get north of that to kind of reset the entire landscape from that standpoint. So that's not a big shocker, but I think the positive thing to take away is that Jeremy Fowler says he's kind of hearing that Things are moving in a positive direction. It's just kind of bridging that final gap to get this thing done and closed. Uh, but again, it sounds like the aiming point for Nick Bosa and his camp is to be paid more than Aaron Donald, which I think makes a lot of sense, um, considering he is an edge defender and he is one of, if not the best end of edge defenders in the NFL. And judging by the fact that he was the reigning defensive player of the year, I think you could say he is the best edge defender in the NFL. So he is going to want to get compensated as such. But again, it is currently Saturday, closing in on 1.30, and Nick Bosa is still not paid. Got to get this done, I would say, by the beginning of the week. If we get into the beginning of the week, it's going to be start. It's going to start to be panic time in regards to if Nick Bosa will play, will not play, and it will continue to drive the news cycle until he is paid, and then we will celebrate and rejoice, and we will finally be able to put this offseason from hell behind us, and we will be able to focus on week one of the regular season we're so close. We are so close to being able to put this offseason behind us. But, hey, time will tell if we'll be able to do that uh, in the coming days or if this will continue to hold out. But as you already know, we're going to keep you updated all the way throughout. So make sure you like and subscribe for more updates.